Yo, what's up? It's Fish. It's episode 3 of the update reveal for Order and Chaos 2 Redemption. There's going to be one more big reveal on Tuesday, and if you like the video, please hit the like, sub, and comment below. This video is all about companions. The new companion system has been added to Order and Chaos 2, where you can acquire pets with buffs and skills that can increase the stats of your character, provide additional skills for your character, or even fight by your side. A companion comes in the form of a badge. You can acquire badges from Cormier at the brand new Companions Association, and there you can also purchase other essentials for your companion. Badges can also be acquired randomly in dungeons from bosses, at merchants, or if you really love grinding and farming, you can go out in the wild and kill a ton of the type of companion mob that you like, and they can also drop the companion version of themselves. Companions have different buffs, debuffs, and skills, and they can acquire more as they're leveled up and evolved. You're going to need to evolve your pets in the same way you evolve your heritage weapon. Feed your companions food to grow them. Uh, bigify your companions with evolution materials. As you can see here, this fully evolved robot companion has three different skills. The one displayed here shows a skill that can cause a stun condition on the target. So there's some pretty cool stuff you can do with your pets. The stats and the companions that you've equipped will also be added to your character stats. And as you can see here, you can equip five different pets four at your slots, and one at your side. As a side note, pets are also able to stack. Uh, so you can use the same version of the pet on your character and create some very different stats. Uh, it's really going to change the scope of the game. My personal thoughts on Update 2 so far. I uh, freaking love pets, man. This is a really cool thing. They look awesome and gigantic, and they can be utilized in many different ways, uh, apart from what they were used for in Order and Chaos 1. I also wanted to point out, in case anyone was wondering, that these companions are not a replacement for mounts. In case anybody was curious, I'm glad to see a better base build of the game, and it's really starting to come together. Uh, personally, I can't wait for lots to be added to PvP, mounts, and some smaller features that we'll probably see later this year. Uh, companions will also be bound, so you're not going to be able to trade them or sell them in the auction house. We might also see some pet items and features added to our guild shops too eventually. The update is coming really soon. There will be one more update video on Tuesday. If you need anything else, you can hit me up on Mob Crush. Mob Crush is the home of mobile gaming for watching live streams and streaming mobile games. Forbes Magazine called it one of the 20 startups that could change the game in 2016. And uh, love your balls. Hit the like, comment, sub, and see you soon.